All the interest, remember, all comes under 10% tax free. Tax free means whatever you calculate, that will be your net answer. Winning from lottery, rupees 25,000. Have they mentioned net in this? They have not mentioned. Then we have to assume that it is a gross only. A warm welcome to one and all. This is your other sir here. Lecturing with us from First Red College, the temple of excellence. And now we are discussing session 5, unit 3 of tax management. The topic called income from other source. Almost we have done with many types of, almost all types of problems in your topic called income from other source. Today we will work out one problem on income from other source. In that you will understand how to go with your interest part. In that how to calculate gross and how to calculate net. So we will work out such kind of problem in today's session. Your agenda is very simple. We will work out problem on income from other source. Now problem number 8. Now in this Mr. Suplab Singh has the following investment. In the previous year ended 31st March 2020. Now, Rs. 11,000, 10% Karnataka State Government loan. In this, first one, second one, Rs. 30,000, 13.5% debenture of LMT Limited listed. Now, so these are the percentage they have given, just multiply and write. Now, next one. 35,000 into 11% security of sugar mill company not listed. Then rupees 32,000 into 10% tax free commercial security. Now next 3,580 received as interest on Tamil Nadu government security. Then rupees 3,600 received as interest on securities of paper mill company not listed so after this we have rupees 4500 received as interest on security of textile company listed these are the informations we have then interest on security is payable on 30th june and 31st december so normally interest will be paid every six months half yearly one similarly in this, they have given 30th June and 31st December. They have given two dates. Half yearly, they have given two dates. Then, the bank charged 1.5% commission on net realization of interest. See, we want net realization, not gross. We want what? Net realization because we need to minus this 1.5% commission. Now, so in this problem, we'll calculate net also gross also in this problem we will calculate net also gross also now all the interest remember all comes under 10 percent 10 percent in the sense what 100 minus 10 is equal to 90 everything if you divide by 90 you will get your gross value everything is in the net value if you divide by 90 you will get your answer in gross value now as per this interest on all securities payable yes it is done next winning from lottery winning from lottery is over then income from agriculture see up to this whatever information they have given it is all about your interest related before that there is a received 3000 as a director fees from here onwards from here onwards, it is separate problem. There is in one problem, there are two units. One will be all on interest and second part will be rest of the interest. Like you have winning from lottery, income from agriculture land, winning from horse race, interest on post office, all these informations you have. So, we will not club these things with interest. In your examination, 
they will give you interest separately they will give you these kind of questions separately they will not mix up but in today's session i mixed up so that in case in your examination if you got the question like interest and general topic how to do we'll do it in today's session now so up to this we'll work out interest later we'll come back for this topic hope you are clear yes so, so just assume that this is part b and this is part a part a as well as part b now as per part a we calculate one by one this is your solution or answer now we'll go one by one in this 11,000 10% Karnataka state government loan 11,000 into 10% it is 1,100 so whatever answer you got this is what net answer whatever answer we got that is called net answer we need to do it for gross also how do we calculate gross very simple so whatever we got 11,000 into 10 by 100 you will get this answer clear hope you are clear yes i'll calculate once so we have 11,000 multiplied with 10 divided by 100 so i got 1100 this is all about your net what about your gross gross is simple we'll go gross for this is the same thing for your gross and net both are same for Canada state government loan it is 10 percent but what about this debenture 30,000 we have 13.5 percent now debentures limited 30,000 into 13.5 divided by 100 so how much you will get 30,000 I'll calculate 30,000 multiplied with 13.5 divided by 100 I got 4050. I got 4050. How do I convert into net? Very simple. For conversion is very simple. How do I convert means on 4050. On 4050 minus tax. On 4050 minus tax. What is the tax? I'll show you. 4050 multiplied with 10 percent it will become 405 4050 minus 405 you will get 3647 now so this much only we needed but in this question they have given minus from net that's why we are calculating net also now in this 35000 into 11 percent 35,000 to 11% you will get 3,850. On 3,850 you calculate 10%. How much you will get? 385. Hope you are clear. Good. Yes. Similarly, 32,000. Now it is a tax free. 32,000 into 10%. 3,200. Why did I do here means because it is tax free that's why i have written answer here on 3200 3200 into 100 by 90 you will get your gross 3555 we have done ulta the reason is very simple this is what tax free tax free means whatever you calculate that will be your net answer if it is not tax free, whatever you calculated, that is your gross answer. But tax free, that's why this answer you got. Add your tax, you will get 3,555. What is gross means? Actual plus tax. This is only your gross. Hope you are clear. Good. Now. Next, 3580 received as interest from Tamil Nadu government. 3580 multiplied with your 10%. 3580, 3580. So these things like 10% Karnataka state government uh, received as an interest on Tamil Nadu state government, then gross net will not do. Will write the 
same value. Now, next, 3600 received as an interest from the secretary of paper mill company. So, 3600 into 10%. How much you will get? 36,000. 3600 into 10 by 100. See, they have mentioned interest received. Interest received. So, we will take 3600 directly. Here, if you add, so you will get 4000. How? 3600 into 100 by 90, you will get 4000. Similarly, 4500 received as interest on security textile company. 4500 into 100 by 90, it will be 5000, it will be 4500. Here you may have little confusion, I will clear that. Now see, here what we did, 32,000 into 10% we did, clear, yes, but we have taken 3580 directly here. Why? Because here they have given value, we are supposed to find out interest. They have given value, we are supposed to find out interest. Here they have given interest directly. We need not to calculate, they have only given you interest. That's why we have not calculated percentage. Now, 4,500 received as interest. Don't calculate interest again, they only given. On security of textile company, 4,500 into 100 by 90, so it will be 5000 and here it will be 4500. Now, in this, your collection charges are what? Take your 23,090 on that 1.5% by 100, it will be your 346. I'll calculate. Now, your collection charges, 23,000 multiplied with 1.5 divided by 100. So I got around 345, 346. If you take 90 rupees like this one, you will get 346. Now, so 25, 135 plus 346, your answer is 24,789. Hope you are clear. Yes. What is your answer? 24,789. Now, so we have done your part one. All the interest related we have done. See, by just looking at this, you will not understand anything. After this session, sit, work out one by one. Your whatever question is given, the question is here only. Read out. See whether interest is there, interest is not there. And remember, even like Karnataka state government, Tamil Nadu state government, don't calculate anything. Whatever amount is given, calculate and write directly. Hope you are clear. Yes. Now, the continuation is, he director in a company from which he received 3000 as a director fees will do that. So, in this, we will work out this. Here, gross and net not required. Director fees. Director fees. How much you collected? So, director of a company from which he received 3000 as a director fees. Take it directly. So, director fees is 3000. Now, later, winning from lottery rupees 25,000. Have they mentioned net in this? They have not mentioned. Then we have to assume that it is a gross only. Now, so winning from lottery 25,000. Winning from lottery, winning from Lottery, 25,000. If the net word is mentioned, then what we are supposed to do? Into 100 divided by 70. Now, this is done. Next. After winning from lottery, what is the next one? This is done. Income from agriculture in Sri Lanka. Now, 
any income from agricultural land is a taxable or exempted it is exempted any income from agricultural land in outside india it is taxable we are supposed to take income from agriculture in sri lanka 10000 income from agriculture in sri lanka so what is the amount given well check so income from agriculture land it is 10000 so we are supposed to take 10000 after this after this we have winning from horse race 15000 fully taxable have they mentioned net or gross they have not mentioned anything winning from horse race winning from horse race now director fees winning from lottery income from agriculture land winning from horse race how much they have given we'll see the amount winning from horse race is 15000 take 15000 now later interest on post office saving bank account now under interest on post office saving bank account what is the limit up to 3500 exempted above 3500 it is taxable now interest on post office saving bank account 5000 they have given so up to 3.5 what exempt now interest on post office saving bank account interest on post office saving bank account interest on post office saving bank account now in this so how much we have we have 5000 out of 5000 what is the limit 3500 will minus that so it is 5000 the limit is 3500 the answer is 1500 what is the answer 1500 then find out the taxable income from other source for the assessment year 2021 now what is the taxable income at this 25 plus 3 28 plus 10 38 plus 15 53 plus yes 54500 i'll add it once yes the total income from other sources 54500 before that 24789 this plus this one what is the total so this is what 24000 789 plus 54,500. Always remember in the question you have interest related question, make it separate. If there are many are there, one or two are there, then you can shuffle with this thing. Now, if you add this, this will be 9 and 8, 2, 9, 7. 79,289. This is your income from other source. Now I'll go to out of the screen. Please take screenshot. So this is your problem number eight. Continuation of problem eight. Solution part one. Solution part two. So this is all about your today's session. Hope you understood how to calculate interest and how to go about your normal one. In this interest, little confusing unless and until you work out at your home. Write down the question, work out at home. Which are the types of interest we have to take full? Which are the types of interest we have to go for 10%? All those calculations, please sit and work out at home.
home. So whatever we have done, we have done with eight problems. Other than these eight, you will not get anything. We have covered almost all kinds of adjustment in these problems. Thank you.